what I want to tell you, talk to you guys about today is more on the lines of what you should do before you search for a job. I'm just going to give you some good overall general tips. Again, you know, we're going to switch back to my really well done PowerPoints. So I'm not even going to waste my time on camera. So, and I want you to see exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, good tips before searching. Only pick something that you're passionate about. Not only does this help the job process of, you know, actually working at the job, it also helps the job getting process. You're going to find that filling out resumes for jobs or filling out applications for jobs that you're really, really interested in, like your dream job, you're going to figure out, you're going to find that it's way more enjoyable than filling out an application for just a random job that you're really not that interested in, but just desperately need a job. So only pick something that you're passionate about. I would say limit desperation. This is a core concept to job getting in general. This is a very key aspect. Never come off as desperate for a job. Ever, 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 ever. Always make it seem like you have options, even if you don't. I'd say use at least two job searching tools. So for me, I use LinkedIn, I use Indeed. I personally think these are the best two, and I do endorse them. So I would say try using those two. You're gonna have pretty good success. So pick out what type of position you want. Go to payscale.com. It's a very detailed, it'll give you a very detailed assessment of what your salary range should be. And you should know this before applying for a job. Make sure you get letters of recommendation. So if possible, get letters of recommendation. To be honest with you, this is a little bit far-fetched for a lot of people. However, if you can get it, get it. You know, it'll save you a lot of time. Not to mention, it, it doesn't have to be a great letter either. You know, a lot of employers will respect the honesty, as long as most of the recommendation is solid and, and positive. That's a good thing. How many jobs should you apply for a day? I would suggest maybe just one or two and really focus on these one or two jobs. See, And before you even apply for a job, make sure you go to their webpage, look at their about us section and see what they're all about. Make sure you're comfortable with it. Because again, you just don't want to waste any of your time in the future. 